Monday morning chaps, we're about to jump in the car, me, Stu, Gemma and Dominic, because he's off school with the squits. <laughs> and we're going across to uh, Newark. I don't know why, because there's a Barclays branch in Retford. But we're changing over the brew shed limited, uh, to a limited company on the bank account, so they want us all to sit in a room and talk to a wanking bank manager for five minutes. Dickheads. So, uh, yeah. Lose half a day doing that. Yay, sounds fun, doesn't it? So I thought I'd take you to Newark with us. Come on, let's go. So we've made it to sunny Newark and parked in Waitrose with all of those uh, plant pot headed people. Right, to the bank. board so bank done change the company over it is now the brew shed limited on the bank account and uh, yeah she didn't give us any extra money though maybe next time so back to Retford there's not a lot of welding gonna happen today is the Gemma no way no way so I made it back to Retford, I quickly got changed. I'm probably gonna get an hour and a half in the shop. I think it's one o'clock now. Pick the kids up at half past uh, three. I'm gonna just do one more cut with this plasma cutter. And then that's a full sheet of steel being used to make the circle things for the tops of the tanks. And I've gotta clean them all up with a grinder, lay the tanks down and start tacking them on. Yeah, and then welding them up. So I ain't gonna get that far today. I'll probably just get the one plasma cut out and then cleaning up with a bit of bit of the old grinder. So there'll not really be a lot of shop footage, I don't imagine, before I have to collect the shield de Ron. But we'll see if we can get a little time lapse of what's going on. cleaned up and all the dross knocked off of them ready to be welded onto the tanks I've got uh, five ten, three yeah, 15 of them cut I need 18 I need 18 to do all the tanks so I'm gonna have to cut three out of another piece might get it out of some scraps actually but it's three o'clock so I've got to go and get Abigail hey chickadee Let's go take you to Nanny's then so Daddy can go back to work. Yeah. I'm actually quite pleased how this is all knitting together. I've got half of the sort of rim thing on, stiffening, whatever it is. And uh, it looks pretty good. So you can see how much more depth now it's given us. That was what the little uh, 10mm by 5mm piece of steel did. And now we've got a good 50 mil depth for insulation to sit behind and although the welds aren't cleaned up yet it's just flowed in there really nicely it looks quite smart and the back surprisingly enough because I'm putting most of the heat onto the bar when I'm washing in it's hardly coking at all at the back one or two places where it has come out but other than that, it's just scorch marks. Yeah, quarter past six almost. Gemma will walk through the door any minute now. My TIG torch has got a little bit hot because I'm running this at 80 amps. So I've just got a foot there to do, 18 inches maybe. And then that's half of this top section done. 
I might have time to do the other half. I don't quite know yet. And uh, I've realised that I've dropped a ball oak because these fittings here are actually, I can't put the nuts on. They'll foul that. So what I'm going to have to do, I'm going to have to drop this down, across and back up again I think. And do something like that and uh, take the insulation down and around these sections. We'll see, we'll see. I will cross that bridge when I get to art. That's it, my old smoky bacon. Turn the fan off. Got the fan here to cool my TIG torch down a little bit so I can do a little bit more running on here. So that's it. That's on, apart from this little bit I have to fathom here. And you can sort of see that uh, she's carrying wampus all over the place. But just a little. It doesn't take much talking to with the old persuader before she gets into position and uh, she looks super freaking duper and these welds well nobody likes a show off and that right Jem nobody likes a show off apart from me and you, do you like a show off? No. No. Never. Oh, freaking sucks. Right, let's go home then. Should we get some beer from Aldi? No. Okay. God damn it. You are going to get some beer, right? No. Yeah. Loads of beer. No beer. Yeah, beer. No beer. Break for beer. Nah. Yeah. Where's Abigail hiding? It's the dildo rail. Dildo, well, it's dildo rail? Yeah. What are you on about? Dildo rail. Dildo rail. <laughs> <laughs> it's comedy gold round here, isn't it? <laughs> oh my goodness. Are you ready to go home? There's a lovely sky over Spitalil at the minute. I think spring's in the air, Abigail. What do you think? Yeah, I do too. Oh, what are we having for tea, Jemski? It may be gammon. It may be gammon. Gammon will do. God, I need to be brewing quickly, boys. I'm on the Aldi specials. See you tomorrow if I make it.